Chapter 31 Now when all this was finished, all Israel who were present went out to the cities of Judah, and broke in pieces the pillars, and hewed down the Asherim, and broke down the high places, and the altars out of all Judah and Benjamin, and Ephraim also and Manasseh, until they had destroyed them all. Then all the children of Israel returned, every man to his possession, into their own cities. Hezekiah appointed the divisions of the priest, and the Levites after their divisions, every man according to his service, both the priest and the Levites, for burnt offerings and for peace offerings, to minister and to give thanks, and to praise in the gates of the camp of the Lord. He appointed also the king's portion of his substance for the burnt offerings, even for the morning and the evening burnt offerings, and the burnt offerings for the Sabbaths, and for the new moons, and for the set feast, as it is written in the law of the Lord. Moreover, he commanded the people who lived in Jerusalem to give the portion of the priest and the Levites, that they might give themselves to the law of the Lord. As soon as the commandment came abroad, the children of Israel gave in abundance the first fruits of grain, new wine and oil and honey, and of all the increase of the field, and the tithe of all things brought they in abundantly. The children of Israel and Judah, who lived in the cities of Judah, they also brought in the tithe of oxen and sheep, and the tithe of dedicated things which were consecrated to the Lord their God, and laid them by heaps. In the third month they began to lay the foundation of the heaps, and finished them in the seventh month. When Hezekiah and the princes came and saw the heaps, they blessed the Lord and his people Israel. Then Hezekiah questioned the priest and the Levites concerning the heaps. Azariah the chief priest of the house of Zadok answered him and said, Since the people began to bring the offerings into the house of the Lord, we have eaten and had enough, and have plenty left, for the Lord has blessed his people, and that which is left is this great store. Then Hezekiah commanded to prepare chambers in the house of the Lord, and they prepared them. They brought in the offerings, and the tithes, and the dedicated things faithfully. And over them Conaniah the Levite was ruler, and Shimei his brother was second, Jehiel, and Azaziah, and Nahath, and Asahel, and Jeremoth, and Jozebad, and Eliel, and Ismachiah, and Mahath, and Benaiah were overseers under the hand of Conaniah and Shimei his brother, by the appointment of Hezekiah the king, and Azariah the ruler of the house of God. Koray, the son of Imna the Levite, the porter at the east gate, was over the freewill offerings of God, to distribute the offerings of the Lord and the most holy things. Under him were Eden, Maniamim, and Jeshua, and Shemaiah, Amariah, and Shechaniah, in the cities of the priest, in their office of trust, to give to their brothers by divisions, to the great as well as to the small, besides those who were reckoned by genealogy of males, from three years old and upward, even every one who entered into the house of the Lord, as the duty of every day required, for their service and their offices according to their divisions and those who were reckoned by genealogy of the priests by their fathers' houses, and the Levites from twenty years old and upward, in their offices by their divisions, and those who were reckoned by genealogy of all their little ones, their wives and their sons, and their daughters, through all the congregation. For in their office of trust they sanctified themselves in holiness. Also for the sons of Aaron the priest, who were in the fields of the suburbs of their cities, in every city, there were men who were mentioned by name, to give portions to all the males among the priests, and to all who were reckoned by genealogy among the Levites. Thus Hezekiah did throughout all Judah, and he worked that which was good and right and faithful before the Lord his God, and every work that he began in the service of the house of God and in the law and in the commandment to seek his God, he did it with all his heart and prospered.